Welcome back, whippersnappers. This is Gramps. We are still playing Dave the Diver. So we had a great night last night. We closed down the restaurant. Didn't make it a whole lot of money, but we did have some, some good eats. Some delicious squid tentacle and beer. And uh, we are looking at a new morning here. We're going to be diving deep, looking for more sea people stuff. And tonight we've got Vincent coming to the restaurant. And we've already got all the ingredients for his dish, so we're good there. We did get a little bit of cash from rewards yesterday. First thing let's do is let's crack open the phone, check in the Cooks to app. And there are a couple posts from the, the crew last night, so we're going to give those all thumbs up. Excellent. And we still need another... Oh, we've got enough followers now. We just need to research a recipe. So, hmm, we could do that. Let's look at the Eco Watcher app. Got a couple of things to turn in. Uh, we can deliver the agar. And that gets us 30 research points. And a new quest, which is this. Um, Kelp and Kajime, which we've got a lot of. So we're going to just go ahead and turn those in. Again, because we've been gathering them as we go, we've got, we've got a lot of this stuff. So we're almost at level 3. Once we get level 3, the Eco Poison Resist Bracelet. That sounds like a good thing. Oh, and we can turn in the Sea Grapes portion of that one. Okay, excellent. We are good to go. Oh, sorry. Back in Eye Diver, we are going to upgrade our diving suit. That's the first thing. And that's it. <laughs> that's the last thing, apparently. <laughs> you see, of course, the upgrades get more and more expensive as you go. As you would expect. And on the weapons... And we're kind of where we were. Okay. We are good. Let's jump on in. Oh, wait. Let's check to make sure... Yeah, we've got the triple axle. Okay. Oh, it's all right. One more thing. See what Cobra is selling today. Uh, we'll take that oxygen capsule, and we will take the gun enhancement. Now, we're going in. Okay, let's do that. Uh, it's taken over for me, so that means we are having a fight. It's our buddy, John Watson. He's blaming us for vomiting. He's going to turn us into fish food by launching a grenade past us and blowing up the actual coral reef. Of course, that's our fault for you know firing the grenade. Another little boss card. Uh, really, those are super cool. First thing I'm going to do is upgrade the weapon. And switch over to that. Boom. Oh. Alright, so when he does that little fist pumping thing, he's getting ready to charge us. Now we've upset him. Is that it? See the triple axle? I'm telling you, for the early game, the triple axle is the way to go. How dare we fight back against him? So again, causing more damage. I'm starting to think this guy might be a little hypocritical. Has opened. Let's go that way to reach the signal. Okay. On the way, we're going to grab this ammo. And you can see we're headed down in the direction of the signal. There's another weapon. Let's see what we've got here. Wow. Look at that. Up to level three. I love it. 
and nothing down here. I think we do. We still need Agar for our Eagle Watcher. No, we do not. We do need red. No, we don't need red starfish either. Okay, we can go this way. Go down and around. We do need to take out a couple of these Triton fish or Titan trigger fish. That's good eating at the restaurant too. Scooter would be nice. There we go. Oh, hello, shark. Who killed us last time? <laughs> Barracuda up there. Ah, nice. An upgraded harpoon. Always welcome. Hmm, I think. Do we need to go up and over? Yeah, I think that will work. It's good to go. I don't want to get into any major battles. Uh, pink seashell. These uh, are the coral trout that I was telling you about last time. Oh, so this is a new little mini game. <laughs> you hit the space bar on that one. Uh, when it gets to the far right green. Boom. Boom. You just sort of get into a rhythm of it and you'll get it. A lot of the a lot of little mini games in this game. And there's more to come. We're at half oxygen, so I'm going to refill. Again, see if this is anything. Oh my goodness, look at that. That is pretty awesome. <laughs> That's where he fills our ammo. I didn't notice that. That's nice. Orange starfish we will grab. And while we're here waiting for that, we'll grab some sea grapes. Those guys are um, aggro. Oh my god, even with all of our upgrades. Atlantic Anglerfish. So here's where that records room was in this map. Okay, let's use one against this guy and then re ammo. And now we're heavy. Oops, I shouldn't be collecting things. Alright, so let's keep going. We're just going down. And we're looking for the, um, the depths. Which is where we will get if you just keep on going down. I think I am going to stop though and just get rid of something here that's heavy because we're not that overweight. Um, we're at 33, need to be at 28. If we get rid of one angler fish, that does it. Okay. Now this is pretty cool. Going down to the blue hole depths. This is the deepest we've gone. Look at that. That's that's pretty cool how that light just turns on. Okay. Um, that guy sees us. And, you know, just takes three shots. The fang tooth. 
orange starfish and a brittle starfish. Our first one of those. Okay, what do we have here? Two worms. Well, it turns out they hate UV light. Okay, let's get rid of a trigger fish. Okay, they hate UV light. We saw that there was this yellow chest. I wonder what's in here. Oh, look at that. It's a UV light. Okay, I figured that was in there. That's why I didn't open it. Okay, so... Oh, is that ammo? Hello. Good. All right, ammo's right there. Good to know. So, uh, middle mouse button. And it sort of clears those guys away. You can usually do two at a time. They grow back pretty quickly. You can see... Yeah, see, these ones are already growing back. So we're swimming past all those. While we're here, let's grab some oxygen. Oh, hello, hello. Let's see, people. Oh, this guy seems a little, uh, a little aggro. We're able to talk to Dr. Bacon from all the way down here. Come back up to the boat now! Okay. Well, it doesn't seem like they're attacking us, so that's good. What do we have in here? More oxygen, which we don't need. Okay, we still have our flashlight equipped. You can move and do it at the same time, but then the power goes down. It's better to do it in quick little bursts. Here's a whole other area. You know what? I'm not. Let's just not. Let's save that for later. As the English beat would do. So we're going to swim up. We're going to catch some more fish. On the way, I'm going to switch uh, this guy so the oxygen canister is our main one. We are at... we're pretty heavy. You know what? We're heavy. Um, was there a... I thought there was an escape pod. I was just seeing the, uh, the clam. There's an escape pod there. Let's go up and look for one of the white tip sharks. Oh my. A sensor bomb. We're just going to get up out of the caves here. And as I said, every time you go down, it can be a different a different map, so that sometimes gets to be a little confusing. Ah, good, a tight trigger fish. We'll take that out instead. And there's a white tip. All right. Wow, look at that. That is the gun being upgraded. <laughs> I can't believe we're not at full capacity yet. <laughs> oh, silver bowl. Sure. Oh, these lionfish. I think, yeah, we need to take those guys out too. For the eco watcher. Why not? We'll use this oxygen quickly. I see an orange starfish, and if I. We've got to be so close to maximum. Oh my god. Alright. There we go. Now we're at maximum. We're just going to swim up and out. And since we've got full. 
oxygen. I'm just giving it the turbo boost the whole way. Ah, oh, there's a silver ball. Too bad, so sad. Okay. Yep. His boat has a very distinctive sound. Hello. The find of the century. And we get 500 gold for the find of the century. Good to know we're, you know, valued. Of course, Cobra wants to immediately commercialize the sea people. <laughs> okay, we need a microphone and an amethyst. Microphone should be below the sunken ship, and the stone tablet is likely to be in their record chamber. And then the amethyst is going to be a mine similar to the copper and lead that we've already seen. Okay. He's using the to-do app, so... Excellent. Our deepest dive by far, 176 meters. And 24 items obtained, 15 fish caught. Oh, here comes our buddy Sato again. Yowie. A boss card acquired from the giant squid. Again, super cool detail. The boss cards are hologram cards. Okay. So we can unlock new card packs. Yeah, when, when are we going to a new region? And now a phone call from Udo, somebody we don't know yet. He is a reporter for a magazine called Weekly Fish. So he's now putting us to job, to work, um, taking pictures. So again, we'll find these little photo spots from time to time, and we'll get to take specific photos. Okay, let's look at the to-do list, and you can see here the amethyst ore. It gives you the the um, the depth intercom microphone that's in the shipwreck. Again, I told you we'd be going back in there, and the Sea People record chamber. So we know where those things are. Let's see if we can knock those out quickly. Oh, quick down here to Eco Watcher. We can turn that in. And now we're at level three. So we get that poison resist bracelet, which is nice. We're not going to equip that yet, though. And still wants shells brown, blue, brown, and pink. So we're still looking for those. Fossils, we need to find. I know we, we found one before, but had to get away because we were about to be attacked. And. Uh, sure, let's buy a scooter. Oh, we have some money. Let's take a quick look, see if we can upgrade anything. We can upgrade our tank and cargo. Let's upgrade our air. We still want to save some money to be able to hire someone else to work at the uh, restaurant. So hopefully we'll, we'll make some money now. Or some of the silver bowls. So we're just heading down. Stopping to get weapon upgrades on the way. Or other blueprints. Basic underwater rifle. Let me already have you. Yeah, you saw how well that upgraded oh upgraded gun worked. Okay, lionfish are good to go for our next eco watcher turn in, and same with the Titan trigger fish. Cat food. Yes, we will give that to Momo.
there is an achievement for giving for feeding the cat 20 times. This, as a gamer, this looks suspicious to me. Can't do anything with it yet. See nothing. Blue and pink. Both are good. Both are on our list. Oh! Alright. So, hard to see, but this is one of these fossils. So I'm going to open it up. And we got a foot bone. Excellent. So we're just looking for those. Every time you open them up, you'll get one seemingly random bone. We're going to collect those for a while. Sure, we'll take another scooter. Oh my. this octopus had to stop and pick up the brown shell though <laughs> oh hey what do you know you stay right there oh goodbye I like how he actually waves goodbye to us before he yeets away Okay, gas cutter time. It's pretty cool, the flaky paint, the rust, and then the rust stains too. Sure you've got enough room on your mouse area to be able to complete this. It's a pretty long one. All right, go to new region. There he goes again. But what's this? Okay. We're never coming back in here. Let's just grab this oxygen. Why not? Sometimes when you go back and forth between regions, it refills your oxygen, but not always. How are we doing on ammo? We're fine on ammo. I'm not even worried about fish. I just want to get to the to the wreck at this point. You don't have to do this all today. Um, you know, we could come back and do this stuff later. Got our good old tiger fish, tiger shark guarding the wreck. See, now we come in here, and um, this is a good sort, uh, good time, place to find these uh, these red fish, the coral trout. There's also going to be some of the green fish, the harlequin hind in here. Okay. There's also a very often a hammerhead shark in here. I don't know if he's in here at this stage in the game. Yeah, maybe not now. So there's a barracuda. And later there will be a sailfish, which is something that we don't 
um, get a whole lot of. I'm going to grab this ammo because, again, we're not coming back here. There's some stuff down here. We'll get to it later. There's nothing you can do with it right now. Okay, so... Uh, okay, so to get to the... Uh, stone the sea people tablet we're just gonna want to go down into the right oh dead end used up our rocket ship A little scooter oh there's another one of these guys let's see what we got we got the foot bone last time now we got the uh, skull We've already got. Okay, so we are we're down too deep for the stone people tablet, but we do have amethyst. So see, hitting the amethyst, we can't chip that. our level one harpoon <laughs> eventually it works you see we do 10 damage to them each time and that's because we upgraded it next upgrade gets us 17 there we go Ugh. all right so we do have this box right here. Oh, that's got that. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. I was expecting the. Uh, I was expecting the um, pickaxe, which is going to be right here. Okay, so we're going to grab that. That replaces our melee weapon. These guys are a pain. You have to just. Sometimes you want to make them come out and charge. We just need one piece, luckily, because the other... Ah, all right, we got it. <laughs> come on, that was, that was pretty good. Just rush in there, grab it, and run away. That's all we need from the depths. Now let's go up a bit and get into that... Uh, see people chamber the record chamber and grab some oxygen while we're here I knew he was going to ink us. <laughs> and grab this. Hopefully that chamber's right up here. I want to let them scoot along ahead of us. Okay. 
Now, of course, we're we're at the heavy limit. And there's the sea ch the chamber. So look at our oxygen too. We're at 170. Let's just see if it resets here when we go in. Nope, it didn't. Like I said, sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. There's one that does all the time. I'll, I'll, I'll point that out when we get there. That's it. Okay, we've got all the stuff. Let's get out of here. There's our Harlequin Hind. Alright, there's an escape pod right here. Let's pull the ripcord. So we're going to get a translator. Excellent. Stuff turned in. Oh, this is the thing from the octopus. Octopus bracelet. Uh, it gives us an extra dash that does not use up our uh, air supply. But I'm gonna, we're going to skip that. We're not going to put that one on. All right. Bunch of says, stop messing around, get in here. We've been trying. We've been trying, Bancho. Okay. Back from Star Chef. And uh, we have Jellyfish Sushi. Alright, so that's a common theme. The person doing the review doesn't want to eat the gross thing that Bancho has made, and then Bancho gets upset with them and guilts them, shames them into eating it. I know it can't possibly taste good. I'm going to leave all those in, but those ones just crack me up. The sea! I can taste the sea! Yes, Pancho has his reasons. Eighty points. Eighty points because we don't serve beer <laughs> hey a thousand gold all right we will put that to good use so beer is going to be similar to the green tea customers are going to order it and we have to pour it and it's it's very similar to the green tea when we get somebody ordering one i'll i'll, I'll show you what we're doing but it's just basically uh, what I'm doing when I serve the beer is sort of a tap, 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 tap. And then the beer mug turns completely vertical. And then you just hold the space bar down. Okay. So a couple of things we want to do before we open up. I know this is a longer episode. A lot of stuff going on. We're kind of come in here to the staff and come to our hire. And we want to hire Carolina. Again, come back here. She's got a decent score with cooking and serving, but procure. She's got a really high procure skill. That's where we're going to eventually use her. For right now, we are going to pop her behind the, the counter with Bancho. Lou is... Um, what was his thing? He's good at serving. Yeah, he's serving and cleaning, so he's decent. We could hire him as well. 
and now let's put out a TV ad. So we'll get three candidates. Now again, even if we can't, you can see that we can only put these people in at certain levels. Uh, so even if we can't use them, they can be in the waiting room, like they are now, waiting room. And then we can move them in eventually, but they could go and procure stuff for us in the meantime. So we're going to swap Carolina into there. But look at this. We're also going to come down here to research. And we're going to research this random recipe. And I think, oops, we did that one too. Okay. <laughs> I think that puts us into silver. So now we've got the staff from Cooks to come in to check us out. Yes, very intimidating with the pink armbands. Excellent. Okay, we are silver. We now have new recipes. We have an extra menu slot, extra serving staff, more wasabi, another cooking slot, and more interior. So that is good news all around. We're going to come back here to staff. And you can see here, we can add another staff member into the dining area. So we're going to do that and select Lou which is good. And we've got a little bit of money. Let's give him some training. Give him at least up to third level, level three. Yeah, we can do that. Okay, now he is able to clean. So that's very helpful. Okay, let's create the menu quickly and then get this knocked out. I'm not going to worry about enhancing or upgrading anything. But look at this. One item is now earning us 225 gold per. That is what we want. More shark head. We're going to auto supply that one. The shark head doesn't need to be auto supplied because we only have one serving of it. Oh, this one we're not going to auto supply either because making one uh, serves five. And we can add, oh, look at that. We've got all those menu items we can add. Seasoned Kajime. That's just one. We'll do this Fang Tooth. Put that on auto supply. And then this giant Trevally meat. We'll put you on auto supply as well. Okay, we are good to go. Open it up. Now we still need to do wasabi. And we will need to serve beers. We're the only one who can serve beers. So Kyoko went and got that tea. See, now they're turning out the fish twice as quick. And again, see how fast the wasabi is going down. Oh, somebody wants a beer, of course, at the very end of the bar. So, here we go. So, I'm going to tap, tap, tap the S key, not the space bar. And now see that the mug is all the way vertical. Perfect. Excellent. Tap, 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 tap. I guess just tap it. <laughs> oh, somebody, he cleaned up, uh, Lou cleaned up a dirty dish. We're out here, we can do it. I'd rather have him serving. Sabi, doing okay. Do just a little bit. We're out of this dish. Out of that, we've got one shark head left. I think we're good to go.
excellent night. More followers. We profited 2,000 gold. 5.0, 5 out of 5 stars. That was a perfect night. That was great. And, of course, Dr. Bacon's coming back. Hello. 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 Uh, all right, he had to get help from Duff, so that means this thing's probably going to explode, which is great. You know what? We're going to call it a day, and this is it for, for this episode, because uh, there's just going to be more stuff coming up, and I don't want to get into a whole thing, lean to another thing, to another thing. So... Thank you for joining us very much, and we will be back with the next day. Uh, probably come out tomorrow. Have a good day. Dave the Diver, this is Gramps, signing off. <laughs>